Good morning. Today is Wednesday, November the 15th, 2017. It's about 7.35 in the morning and 40 degrees. I'm going to take Larry into Hardy's. I've got a dentist appointment to get my teeth cleaned. And i got to pick up odds and ends at Walmart. It's so crowded, you can't hardly get in here. Now he's got to tiptoe around the lantana. It's too crowded. Now the birds can have breakfast. <coughs> We're here at the landfill, dropping off garbage. I'm here at the dentist's office. I'm about 10 minutes early, so I thought I'd just wait here in the car for a while. Got Larry dropped off at Hardy's. There's a squirrel running around there. And the acorns falling off a tree. There's two squirrels. back at Hardy's to get Larry. I called him to let him know I was coming. Got his coffee and in a newspaper. We're here at Murphy's getting gas. I, got, I don't know if you can see that tank over there. Somebody hit it and kind of beat it up. Carried in the firewood for today. That'll be for them today and tonight and in the morning. I carried in another bucket of pine cones to start to fire in the morning if we need them. We bought this newfangled mouse trap at uh, Walmart this morning, and while I was trying to figure out how to bait it, I caught my finger. Luckily, I wasn't hurt. There's been a mouse in the freezer room eating our sunflower seed. And the last two nights, I've had a trap in there, and he tripped it both times, but we didn't catch him. Hence the new trap. The way this works, I put the peanut butter in there, flip that down, and then we pull this back. And then he sticks his head in that hole to get the peanut butter, and it catches him. I think that's the way it works. This is something else, another improvement. Larry put this light here in the closet for me, but I could the only way I had to turn it on and off was with a pot holder. And I didn't like to do that, so I didn't use it too much. So I got this little socket extension, that white part with the chain. So now I pull the chain and I have light. And just, just pull it again to turn it off. We got the firewood put in now Larry's back at it with his alias. We're 
we're going to build a platform here under the window and then we'll pass the firewood in through the window. And so we've got the first post hole dug for the for the rail support and railing. Got to dig another one out here. So that's where we are. And I don't have to my hair or anything. Well, nice to have a wife to do a man's work. I might let her build the whole thing. <laughs> well, I hit a root. Larry had to take over for a little while. Put in the first string. I cleaned out the back of my fit and put the seat down because tonight we've got Bible study and we're going to, while we're there, we're going to pick up the 55 Christmas shoe boxes. In the next day or two, we'll take them to the next distribution point. We forward them on again. So we're going to put 55 boxes in there that are, well, our church donated 51 and First Baptist donated four. So I think they'll all fit in there. Well, since I helped Larry with the post holes, he's helping me with supper. I got a roast in cooking. He's peeling the potatoes and cleaning the carrots. There's the beef roast that I cooked. And in here is the potatoes and carrots and celery and onions. They're down under there. Not too shabby. Should be pretty good. It's 5.23 and the sun is down. It's 5.35 and we have a pretty sunset. I don't think it shows up on camera as pretty as it is. We're ready to leave church. We had a substitute tonight. Uh, right there is the man that taught us. <laughs> he did a real good job about why worry that we shouldn't worry and just doing our best. Good night. God bless.